So hello, today we're going to make some chips back like these I made from my portfolio, so um, let's go. Step one, grab yourself some chips from your local supermarket or just go into internet and find something, whatever you prefer. So let's go. Step one, make it a little bit thinner and apply texture. Go into the UV editor and align this beautiful texture and make it chip size. Right. Now we're going to add a bunch of loop cuts, around 100 on each side. There we go. Now we're going to select every second point because we like hard labor and there's definitely not another way to do this. It's very easier. There we go. Also, did I mention that you also have to select the one behind it in X-Ray? No? Oh well, fun doing it again. There we go. Now we're going to just pull them down and do the same at the bottom too. Make three loop cuts here. And there, then add a close modifier, the vertex max to zero, and the gravity as well. Then add a force field, and crank up the strength to a million. Let it play, and let it inflate. It can take some time, so I'm going to skip that a little bit. There you go. And add, add more loop cuts. Make it three, and more. Select three lines, extrude them. Cancel that, and scale it a little bit, and do the same for the bottom. Apply the modifiers, and delete the force fields. Make it smooth. Done is your beautiful bolognese chips back. Who's going to eat that?